Hey YouTube, this is Nordic Brit, bringing you another little update video on everything that's been going on around the world lately. Um, I just wanted to basically put a message out there that, you know, 2020 and 2021 so far has just shaped up to being terrible years with the pandemic and uh, economic worries, storms, um, kind of movements in the Wall Street uh, and cryptocurrency and everything else that's going on there is kind of really crazy right now. Um, you know, we've had takeovers in different countries and coups and Ebola is kind of breaking out again in parts of Africa. We've got new variants of coronavirus, uh, whether or not the vaccines can handle it. It's a whole nother thing. It's just so much going on right now in the world. So now is even more important than ever to be prepping, to be looking at what food you have stored away, uh, medicines that if you need them, and to look at your financial security. You know, when the world is going through so many things right now, it's really important to consider what chain effect that has. You know, just because something happens in the United States, for example, doesn't mean that it won't have an effect in other countries and vice versa. It's we're So we are living in a time where everything, the system is slowly being strained of energy and it's going to cause knock on effects. So I'm not expecting 2021 to get any better, really, um, for some months uh, at the very best. You know, the Wall Street market itself, the whole stock market is just a massive bubble right now. That's rippling over to the crypto uh, market as well. There's a lot of bubble activity there. Of course, it can go higher. There's money to be made. However, there is a point in which it will crash and correct itself. And then there's also the issues around physical security so you're talking about storms you're talking about coronavirus you're talking about any other viruses that might come about you're talking about economic struggles uh, you know millions and millions and millions of jobs have been lost uh, in the last year and a half alone and that's not looking to be getting any better anytime soon so just uh, keep it in mind folks just remember that things are really precarious right now um, and when situations get like that, you start to get more activity around things like the rich and elites buying water rights, for example. Uh, that's happening a lot lately in the last 24 months or so. There's been a huge uptake in that, um, as well as kind of big uh, whales coming into the crypto market, which essentially is going to skew it in favor of rich elite again uh, with, the, with the normal currency. So there's so much kind of things happening right now beyond the pandemic itself that we have to really consider where are we going and you have to consider first where are you going uh, where is your family going and how do you keep yourself uh, safe going forward um, you have to try to play the game to get out the game so to speak but you also need to consider that the game might stop um, or the game might continue for ages and just become harder and harder. So just keep those things in mind. Um, you know, I'm sure I'm going to put out some more videos on some various topics coming soon. But just uh, remember that things right now are quite delicate and you never know what the future might hold for your security regarding your job, your finances and things around you. You only have to look at like a freak storm in Texas and the rest of the United States to see how quickly things deteriorate really, really quickly. Um, and, you know, it's just you only have to go online and have a look and see and things can move south very quickly um, and you just don't know. So be prepared for different kinds of eventualities. Don't put all your eggs into crypto. Don't put them all into the stock market. Uh, you know, make sure you've got food first. Make sure you've got water because, I mean, there are people in the U.S. now starving and have no water. So any amount of crypto and stocks are useless. It's you need uh, tangible things first. And then you can try to look at financial independence with other things. As always, stay safe, everyone. Nordic Brit out.